تنطلق في دبي الأسبوع المقبل فعالية قمة المدن المستقبلية العربية والتي تعد منصة لمعرفة المزيد عن الخطط الواسعة والتكنولوجيا والتطورات والمشاريع والاستراتيجيات التي من شأنها دفع نمو مدينة دبي في المستقبل يوسف التقى الرئيس التنفيذي لشركة هايف تكنولوجي المشاركة في القمة وسأله عن تقنية الهوية الواحدة ودورها في تطوير المدن الذكية Unified identification is something that's been talked about for a long time. Um, if we look at sci-fi movies, um, since the 1970s, there's already been identification that has been um, sort of automated and people would walk through a door and it will just open. Um, this technology um, in today's modern society is still lacking. And it's one of the biggest problems because we all carry cards and keys and remotes and all these things in our pockets to actually manage our world. With the introduction of the Internet of Everything or the Internet of Things, we basically are going to have more and more interactions with objects. Now currently these interactions basically happen through applications on our phones or devices. So it's just going to become more chaotic because we've got more and more things to do to actually manage the world around us. Single identification or unified identification basically bring that all into one device that is like a front end and can actually identify you to other devices, to other um, providers, other technologies, etc. ما هي التكنولوجيا المستخدمة في صناعة تلك البطاقات وما مدى الحماية التي توفرها للمستخدم بنفس الوقت؟ Okay, so security is really important once we start to look at a single identification. The reason for that is that we can now be seen and tracked and it can be basically used to position where people are. Not that we are not providing that information as it is on our cell phones today, but To be a proper single identification, we need to take account of, of security. Um, this specific product basically makes provision to um, secure it. So when the data is transmitted, it's encrypted, and it's encrypted individually by, by ID. Um, and secondly, it is basically something that can't be copied like we see with current bank cards. Um, once the identity is, is set up and configured, it will basically have a life of its own. It ages in different ways. It actually takes environmental factors into account and it creates a unique, like a, uh, um, a digital DNA. كيف يمكن لمثل هذه البطاقات الذكية أن تسهم في تطوير وصناعة المدن الذكية برأيك؟ Smart cities is actually just a combination of different technology solutions. Now what makes it very important to have a unified identity is you don't again want to identify yourself in different ways to get different services. With a unified identity you basically have one identity device that could also be your phone and that basically opens up all or give you access to all services um, that constitute a smart city. With smart cities you can also imagine that this one device will enable you to pay your parking as you park. You don't need to walk up to a meter and put coins in or um, SMS a message because it identifies that you're in the parking lot. The same identity could also be applied to, app, uh, to assets like a vehicle. So a vehicle could have an electronic number plate which is one of these same devices and that could identify the vehicle wherever the vehicle is going. Um, and similarly, um, if you go through a toll booth or um, a toll gate, that um, could happen automatically. So it's bringing it at one device could become everything Um, that you need to, to sort of manage your life. ماذا عن خدمة العملاء؟ طيب كيف يمكن لها أن تسهم في تسريع وتسهيل عملية خدمة العملاء في كافة دعنا نقول الشركات أو المؤسسات برأيك؟ With a wireless single identification, it becomes possible for, like your bank, for instance, to identify who's standing in front of the counter before you open your mouth. So um, as you walk through the city. 
your it could basically tell you on your phone that there is certain places of interest or you're close to a restaurant that you like. Um, but all these things are basically configurable once you've got a unified identity. Um, and the purpose of that is really to to make it simple for people to live. And we see that with like the complication that come in with additional technologies, additional ways of identifying us, um, it, it, it life becomes quite hard and complex. In future, we will basically have one thing that will identify us and things around us will start to happen automatically. مؤخرا سمعنا عن مباحثات ما بينكم وبين حكومة الإمارات عن تطوير وخلق مثل هذه البطاقة في الدولة إلى أين وصلتم في ذلك وهل من شيء سيتم الإعلان عنه قريبا؟ um, Hive Technology is launching this at the Arab Future City Summit on the 2nd of November. We have been in discussions with some government departments but um, we are basically only going to start to really focus on working with the government after the launch on the 2nd.